In the Mastering Lower Limb Tendinopathies course, Peter Marlieris said that tendinopathies are always a load tolerance issue and sometimes a biomechanics issue. If you look at the patellar tendon, this means that the load tolerance stuff is the strength of the quadriceps and strength of the patellar tendon. Heavy isometrics, heavy strength exercises that involve knee extensors are going to help pretty much all people. One of the potential biomechanical factors is eversion of the calcaneus. If you don't have eversion of the calcaneus, all of the internal rotations, all of the shock absorption that should happen at the lower limb might not be happening like it should. You may be missing out on eversion of the calcaneus because of a past ankle sprain or something like that. If you played basketball, that has definitely happened. So if you look at this, you go from supination all the way over to the left, pronation. Pronation goes along with eversion. What I'm doing here is looking at pronation of the foot. This is Gary Ward's wedges, Gary Ward's to wake your feet up those are sources you should seek out but as i pronate i need to have the ability to evert the calcaneus this causes the shock absorption throughout the entire lower limb what i'm doing here is testing eversion of the calcaneus you can do this yourself just simply sit there see if you have the ability for that bone to turn outwards if you don't you just do a few reps of this and it should open up over time that is a potential factor that could be causing more stress on the knee try it out enjoy <laughs>